What's up, you guys? This is Steven, and I'm back with another lyrical analysis. This time, I'll be analyzing the song No Bra Sleepwalking by M.A.A., a.k.a. Ma. At least that's what I say, a.k.a. Ma. And this lyrical analysis was requested by YouTube user J-Pop Karaoke, so thanks a lot for the request. And as well, um, this song can be found on M.A.A.'s album entitled Bubble Man Engine. Dun -dun -dun, dun -dun -dun, dun -dun 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 but um, <clears throat> with all that being said, here we go with the lyrical analysis. Here we go. Let's just go right into this. All right. No, no, no bra sleepwalking. People only look backwards. No, no, no bra sleepwalking. But where are you heading? So here, I'm thinking that this song isn't totally what it seems like it's about. Because it's like, oh, you're sleepwalking without a bra. Seemingly. But I'm guessing that she is trying to say, like, people are, you know, moving, but not really... They're, like, moving and doing things, but not really conscious of it. And she's saying, like, people only look backwards. And sometimes, you know, people do look backwards, you know. But, um... For me, I'm guessing that people seem to only look, a lot of times seem to only be concentrating on right here, like right what's in front of them. Um, let's see. No, no, no bra, sleepwalking, but where are you heading? Don't know. You know, if you're looking backwards, then you probably won't really know where you're heading because you're so concentrating or concentrate, concentrated on what's behind you. You can't really look and see what's in front of you. When you're this, you know, when you're like just so fixated on the past. <clears throat> Let's see. Next lyrics. If I hadn't experienced the feeling that I didn't want to experience, no one would talk about me. Behind my back now. So she has experienced something. Maybe she has gotten her epiphany. Or maybe she just. You know, did some drugs. I don't know. Uh, one of the two that I, you know, she experienced a feeling that she didn't, that she hadn't experienced before. And, you know, she didn't want to experience it, but she had to. Well, you know, she didn't have to, I guess, but she experienced it. You know. Now, people are talking about her because of this. Behind her back. Hmm. Yeah. But, you know, that's what it is, especially when you're in the um, entertainment industry. People are going to talk about you, you know. You can't help that. But, hey, just take it as, like, a good thing. Because if no one was talking about you, that's, like, the ultimate, you know, just the bad, like, the worst thing. Because you got to have people talking about you one way or another, you know. Let's see. Really, just a little space in your heart is enough. I just want you to leave it in my room. So she wants to be a part of someone's heart. All right, she wants to be in someone's heart. You know, a little space to do. She doesn't want the whole thing, you know. And that's, you know, that's good because some people kind of want the whole thing. But, you know, you have to spread your love around. You can't just put it all on one person. Let's see. Next lyrics. Um, no, no, no bra. Sleepwalking. People only look backwards. I want to ask those people. Or ask those people. Where are you heading? And I try, 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 try. I, eh. So she is trying. And I cry, 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 cry. I, eh. And she's, you know, she's trying to cry. I'm rehabilitating. So she's, you know, she's, you know, she's rehabbing herself. Because of this experience, you know, she's trying to fix herself because she doesn't want to be like uh, without her bra, sleepwalking, looking backwards. She doesn't want to be like those people, you know. So she has realized it. Now she's trying to rehab herself. 
So, you know, hang in there. Do your thing. I take turns in life and I get hurt. So I'm guessing she's either taking a turn as in, like, turn left, turn right. Or either taking turns as in, you know, hey, you can go now and I'll go later. <clears throat> but anyway, I, I'm guessing it's the left and right types of turns. And she's getting hurt. Listen, I don't make excuses, though. I should be good at it. So she ain't making no excuses, though. She's going to just own it. Let's see. I try my heart. Let's see. Try my hardest to find a filter. So she's trying to filter herself. She's trying hardest to find that filter. Hmm. But I don't think you should totally filter yourself, though. You're saying some interesting things up in the song, and if you're filtering it, then you might not have these interesting songs. Next lyrics. Pride. Let's see. Collecting pride in a box for lost items. Go back to back. Today's a raindrop. Let's see. Today's raindrops tickle me. So... Okay, so she's collecting pride in a box. I'm sure that's metaphorical for something, but I don't know what. Go back to back. She's being tickled by the raindrops, you know? So it's, you know, drizzling, maybe. Let's see. No, no, no bra sleepwalking. People only look at today's happiness. Feeling satisfied. They lose sight of the road ahead. But I try, 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 I, and I cry, 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 I, but I'm rehabilitating so again these people are only fixated on the here and now which I mentioned before and the past I guess they're not really looking toward the future and planning for it and I see that a lot you know where people don't really seem to plan for the future don't really seem to have much foresight so yeah that's an issue especially when it comes to like retiring and stuff like if you ain't planning for it, it's probably not going to be such a, you know, easy thing to go into, you know. But, you know, it seems like she has realized the error of her ways and she's trying to rehab that. So, good for her. Let's see. Next lyrics. I'm no good at being an adult. When I'm sober, so I sleepwalk with no bra. But it's fruitless. So here she's saying, you know, she's no good at being an adult when she is sober. But I'm imagining when she's not sober, she would be even worse at being an adult. So I don't think, you know, alcohol is the answer here. You know, she sleepwalked with no bra, but it's fruitless. You know, it doesn't bear any fruit. Like, it doesn't really, you know, accomplish anything. You know? So, again, it seems like she's really realizing, you know, she has maybe received her epiphany in this situation. Let's see. I already did that part. And I already did that part. And I already did that part. So, those are all the original lyrics to this song. Sleepwalking without a bra. You know, well, no bra sleepwalking, basically. Um... So what if it's a dude? He wouldn't be wearing a bra anyway, so, you know. But I guess she's saying, like, the no bra part, that kind of seems to throw me for a loop, you know. But I'm guessing she's saying, you know, that she is just going ahead and she hasn't really, like, you're sleepwalking, so you're just doing things without really having any, like, consciousness of it. And the no bra thing, I guess that kind of factors into it because you're like, hey, where's your bra at? You should be wearing a bra. So, okay, I think I'm kind of getting where she's going with that. Um, I think these lyrics, I like these lyrics. They're really, really, like, like outside of the box a bit, you know, edgy. It's just like, okay, I get it. And she's comparing sleepwalking to just, you know, living without, I guess, a purpose or living mindlessly or living without consciousness. And I'm like, okay, I get that. I get what you're saying there. But, you know, overall, I like this song. I like it a lot. Um, it's a good song, definitely. 
Um, let's see, what else I can really say? I think I might have said all I can say about this song. Hmm. Uh, I guess I can say, you know, I do kind of feel like that. I feel kind of where she's coming from. But I feel like I'm where she's at. Where I'm like, she realizes it. I realize it too. And I'm trying to, you know, rehab it, you know. You know, rehabilitate myself as well. I'm trying, but, you know... It's, you know, it's a battle, you know. It's not as easy as it, as you think it is sometimes. But I'm in a situation, I guess, similar to hers, too. So I can relate. But, um, you know, I'm trying my best. And I think I'll accomplish, you know, my goal, but... Then again, sometimes I have been in situations where I'm so close to doing what I got to do, but then something comes up and it totally just throws it off, you know? It just, just throws off the goal. And you're like, once that happens so many times, you're thinking, okay, this is never going to happen, you know? Um, sidebar for a second, you know, you know, there's a musical artist, you know, who I won't name, but this musical artist said, you know that she was um, had five different record deals, and she pretty much got nothing out of them. I think it's either she got something out of the fifth one, or either it was the sixth one that worked. One of the two, but she had five different record deals. You know, she's thinking that this was never going to happen because she would get signed, but then nothing would come from it. You know, but ultimately something came from it, and she was able to get something out of it. It took a long time though, but you know. You got to, I guess, have that tenacity and just keep working for it if you really want it. But, you know, I've gone on for long enough. That's all I have to say for now. Thanks a lot for watching. Feel free to comment. Feel free to, you know, subscribe. Feel free to, to subscribe to my channel. And, you know, as well, feel free to give me a thumbs up. It's appreciated very much so. And thanks a lot again to YouTube user Jpop Karaoke for the request. Adios and goodbye for now.